Hello, friends and colleagues. My name is Dr. Rachel Isinawasis, and I'm a dermatologist based in Saskatchewan. I have a special interest in medical dermatology, rural outreach and virtual care, skin of color, and Indigenous health. I welcome you to attend our third annual Indigenous Skin Spectrum Summit, hosted by Chronicle Companies, upcoming on Saturday, November 25th, virtually across Canada, being chaired by myself and Dr. Sibold. This summit is dedicated to improving the cultural competence of Canadian healthcare providers and gives practical advice on providing dermatologic care to rural and Indigenous patients. The summit starts at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 9 a.m. CST, and 8 a.m. MST and PST, again on Saturday, November 25th, virtually. Our first two summits held in 2021 and 2022 have had a diverse variety of speakers, many being Indigenous. We've held important conversations around topics such as an overview of historical context, culturally safe care, listening to the Indigenous patient, health comorbidities, fundamentals of skin of colour, the role of nurses and other allied healthcare providers, and virtual care amongst others, all embedded within holistic skin health conversations. We've also hosted speakers on their international experience from Alaska and the US and Australia. This year, we start out with a clear evidence-based call to action to policy and decision makers on Canadian Indigenous skin conditions to address the highest priorities of importance, which is based on clinical experience and evidence-based reviews. Here, we have a group of powerful speakers from around the world, many from Indigenous backgrounds coming together to explore topics such as the role of virtual care for Northern and rural Indigenous communities, disparities in healthcare access between urban and rural areas. We review Arctic dermatology, the Greenland experience, and the role of an eczema school, which I think we need. The role of the housing environment, uh, working with communities and research, and looking at the relevancies of social determinants of health and Indigenous skin, uh, we also look at. There are deep concerns we are seeing in North America with regards to poorly controlled skin disease in Indigenous peoples. But solutions are present, and it is time for us to make multi-stakeholder plans to address these problems. The skin is a manifestation of both internal and internal health, external health. What this means is by advocating for skin health, we can advocate for the whole person and community. How can you be an advocate? Come and join us at the summit coming up on Saturday, November 25th to learn more. Information for registration is here. I also encourage policy decision makers to attend who are interested in bridging gaps to improve care. Here includes our information to sign up. Registration is free for students or other interested parties with a healthcare practitioner connection. So thanks for your time and I hope to see you there.